don't know if you noticed, but there were a lot of trailer drops recently because of San Diego Comic-Con. Apparently, there's a Dungeons and Dragons movie coming out, and apparently the trailer makes it look kinda good. So, I'll be the judge of that. I haven't seen the trailer yet. I am excited to see it. I am what you might call a fledgling critter. I watched and really enjoyed The Legend of Vox Machina, although I haven't actually done like the Critical Role podcast thing just yet. I also dabble in d and I've played a little D&D. I don't have a long campaign going right now. I've had one in the past. I've done a few dungeon dives in my time, but again, Let's just say I'm a fledgling Dungeons & Dragons fan also. So, I'm excited to see this trailer, to see if maybe it's got the same kind of potential that Vox Machina had, obviously, in a different way. And I'm just gonna dive right in. Before I do though, please, if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, like this video if you enjoy it, maybe comment on it, basically any interaction helps. It helps my channel and it's completely free. So I don't wanna wait any longer, we're gonna get into this Dungeons & Dragons trailer. Let's go. Wait, Chris Pine is in this? <laughs> oh. Okay, okay. Here's the thing. We're a team of thieves. I when you do this. Sounds like Vox Machina. You're bound to make enemies. Sometimes. <gasps> Rene Jean Page? Bridgerton? That's kind of gross. I'm intrigued. It's like Guardians of the Galaxy, Vox Machina. When you help the wrong person steal the wrong thing. We didn't mean to unleash the greatest evil the world has ever known. Kind of like Vecna. But we're gonna fix it. Ooh, we're gonna fix it. Oh, baby. She's in this? What? Fighting chance. We really need strength. You got this, right? I know you don't. I love her voice. I know you don't. We also need courage. Magic. And you. This one. That is the cutest little thing. <laughs> Yeah. This one's dangerous. But whatever happens. Yeah. Lots of dragons. Lots of dragons. Oh, here we go. That's very Thor. Okay. Existing plan fails, I make a new plan. So you make plans that fail? No. He also plays the loot. Not relevant. <laughs> He's barred. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay. So the kid in the middle. I I recognize him. Can't remember where from though. Where do I recognize him from? Somebody please help me. Also, I feel like this looks really fun, but I'm not sure the CGI is gonna be like the greatest I've ever seen, just based on the trailer. Um, like. What is that again? Honestly, like, who cares? It's D&D, &D. like, you're not gonna think that you're in the world or whatever, so if it, I, I don't think it'll take you out of it that much if the, if the CGI isn't, like, perfect. That guy is British, he's in rom-coms, and I can't remember his name, uh, so that's embarrassing, but that'll be interesting to have him in this. There's a lot of famous people in- oh, that was a perfect example of the CGI being- see what I mean? Like, I guess maybe because these care these creatures are so, like, overdone and fantastical that no matter what, they would look fake or whatever, but, um, that is a fat little dragon right there. That is so funny, assuming that's a dragon. So the vibes that's giving off to me are, as I said, like Guardians of the Galaxy meets Vox Machina, and I'm not mad about it. I really love Chris Pine and Michelle Ramirez, I think that's her name, and Renee Jean Page. I feel like this cast is just like 
like that makes me want to watch it for sure but then also this looks like a lot of fun like who doesn't love honor amongst thieves who doesn't love a heist movie you know or uh, underdogs being thrust into a position of needing to be a hero like i love all that stuff so i'm kind of i mean you might have noticed i'm kind of easy to please when it comes to stuff like if it's fun if it's got good dialogue if the characters you care about them um if a story has some kind of reasonable arc that ends hopefully uh with a nice ending i love happy endings but i'll take something dissonant as well every now and then i'm gonna enjoy watching the movie is this gonna be like number one on my list this year or next year i guess 2023 uh i don't know i guess we'll see <laughs> i kind of doubt it but it i'm sure we'll probably go see this in theaters because because this looks like a bit of a spectacle and what better way to see a spectacle than in a theater also, I love the movie-going experience. Like, even though some people in the movie theater can be absurd, I still like going. I think it's a, a fun, like, date night or whatever. I want to see Chris Pine get back into the Star Trek universe, because I actually enjoyed those. Um, you know, J.J. Abrams, Lens Flare, all that stuff. Uh, I don't know if those are in the works or not, but I'm glad to see him in other action movies, because he's a good... He seems like a good guy. So am I going to just be, like, a D&D &D fan without really playing a ton of D&D. &D. I don't know. D&D, &D, it feels like it's coming into the mainstream more and more, and I'm kind of digging it. It's like nerd culture, but but it doesn't matter anymore, right? It's going to be in a movie. It's going to be in Stranger Things, and that's kind of like, people are embracing it, and I love that. I want to bring more people in to the nerd culture. That's my, that, those are my people, you know? Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, this trailer looks good to me. I'm going to watch it for sure. Before I conclude, I just want to say thank you again to my amazing, amazing patrons. A whole list of them is going to be in the description of this video. You guys are the bomb.com. If you want to support me monetarily, you could become a patron on Patreon or a member on YouTube. Otherwise, it always helps if you like, comment, share, do whatever on the video, and make sure you're subscribed to the channel and hit the little bell for notifications. That's it for me. I'll be doing another reaction video very soon, probably for the Lord of the Rings trailer and most likely House of the Dragon, so I'll be looking out for those. Until next time, bye!